Brooklyn. Bro, I think I'm feeling your pink eye, eh? <laughs> Why are you surprised that I want to see everything? I don't know. Like, I'm just... It's just weird. Don't the glasses get in the way? I'm not fucking with my eyes. <laughs> so how long is a quickie for you? Ah, uh, about 10 minutes. Yeah, sing too, lady. Let me too, lady. too, lady. It was uh, like a breath of fresh air, man, really, honestly. Yeah, uh, see what you did there. Uh, no, no. I was like, look, 50 talk. minutes. No. <laughs> 50. Oh. But, man, seconds and minutes. Kinda. I mean. No, shout out to Black Studios, man. Shout out hey. to Black Studios, man. Oh, they're Have doing an amazing the job. Hey, mm. on point. Eh? Mm. And I know all it took was to uh, fire one nigger. <laughs> I would have fired one nigger long ago. For perfection. <laughs> Is this all the things you wanted to do? <laughs> but you were being blocked. <laughs> now they're all wear black when we record. Hey, hey, dude, this week I, I, I finally know what it feels like to be a chiller, bro. Like yeah. when you guys were recording on Sunday, I kept calling Kanye. I even called you. I called everybody. I'm like, hey, how's the show going? What did you guys talk about? Hey, when is it dropping? 3 p.m. I was there. <laughs> but the chillers were all you were watching. Yeah. Did you not comment? Huh? won't quibble. What do you mean? <laughs> you know I'm, I'm recovering uh, eye infection, what, what? So are you protecting us or you can't see? No, I can see. It's just that... Uh, I think there's still a bit of like uh, redness in my eyes, so I don't want it to show on camera. Oh, oh, is it not showing? No, no, it doesn't show. Oh, wow, man. But how was it watching from the other end? Oh, it was dope, man. Yeah. It's doping a chiller, bro. <laughs> For real. Fuck, I enjoyed it, man. Yeah. Yo, shout out to DJ Fresh. Yeah, Yo, shout out to Fresh. Fuck it. Yeah. Did you enjoy the show? Yeah, I enjoyed it, man. Did you subscribe? Are you a member now? <laughs> <laughs> Are you supporting us? Yeah. Or you're also just supporting I'm a <laughs> the eyeballs? You're all <laughs> You're yeah, there, eh? Hey? You know, you're commenting there, eh? Hey? Oh, oh, man. man. Oh, without a Oh, it was beautiful, yeah, man. Shout out to Tato, man. Shout out to Fresh. It was uh, like a breath of fresh air, man, really, honestly. Yeah, I see what you did there. <laughs> no, no. So that was even a part. 50 or... minutes. No. <laughs> 50. Oh. But man, seconds and minutes. <laughs> no. 50 seconds. So, cute, he's trying minutes. to be like you. Angiri is trying to, you know, <laughs> with that the man, glasses. has been killing. Come on now. Hey, dude. Uh, so, it was so surreal calling Fresh to ask him to stand in for me. Yeah. Because uh, I'm an avid Fresh like fan, bro. So, it's like, I grew up listening to the guy. I used to record his shows on uh, cassette tapes. Mm. So uh, when I'd go to school, I'd record it on a cassette and come back home and listen to the show. Yeah, like yeah. even on holidays, yeah, I'd dude. wake up, listen to Tato and Tato, yeah, and then go yeah, back yeah. to sleep, you know? I, I don't know how you didn't think of him, because you asked me, like, hey, who should we call? Yeah. I'm like, fresh, obviously, you yeah, know? Yeah, like, yeah. I mean, his family, he's, yeah. we both, everybody here loves fresh. Yeah. And I remember uh, one of the very first times I saw fresh was, um, I don't even remember a deal, a deal. I know Adil, your mama's favorite DJ. Yeah. That's his tagline, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So when I was in high school, I used to uh, steal my mom's car on Fridays because he was doing Club <laughs> Y. So I used to steal my mom's car and then I'd pick him up and I'd go to Club Y to wife. You took a deal with your, your mom's car. <laughs> <laughs> so he's your mom's favorite DJ. <laughs> <laughs> So every weekend, idea. every weekend I'd steal my mom's car, go pick up a deal, then we'd go to YFM. Yeah. And then the one time uh, Fresh was doing a one-on-one -on -one battle with DJ Kent live on air. And, Kurt, and Kent murdered him, dog. Like fucking... Fucked up who? Fresh! Kent. Yeah. Okay, that's believable. Kent is a super DJ. Though. And then that's how Kent started being on the uh, drive time show. And that, like being a regular. And that goes to show the spirit of Fresh. Yeah. Somebody else would be like, you killed me. Fuck you. Yeah. You know what I mean? yeah. Fuck I'm you. Violent. You know what I mean? But he's like, oh shit, you're better than me? Yeah. Oh fuck, I'll put you on. I'll you know what I mean? Even like when you do a show with them, that's why if you look at the likes of your poppies, Joanna, and everybody else, he literally... If he sees your greatness, he allows it to grow and he feels it. As opposed to some people when, like, you you know, work with them and they're like, ah, 
They try to block your shine. Yeah, 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 but with Fresh, he's like, oh, fuck, you killed me in a DJing competition. How about you play on my show? Because mm. it's to the benefit of who? The listener. Mm. And a person who's a purist at what they do always cares for the listener or the chiller in our case. Yeah. Mm. Hey, but that show of yours is long, eh? An hour and 40 minutes is long, eh? I think I'm 40 minutes in. I still it's got an hour to you go. Know when I, leave. I, kept on, I kept on kicking him under the table. Like, no, no, wrap this shit up. I had to say, okay, we're coming from my Shabbat Studios. Right? I had to fucking, he didn't want to go, bro. He didn't want to. He didn't want to. He didn't want to go. Like, shame, you should have seen him before the cameras are off. Like, yeah. you know, it's like, it was like, like, it looks at the mic. Like, <laughs> like, like, yo, French dog. You know it's gonna take all of us to yank you out of there, right? <laughs> so please, voluntary stand up and leave. Like he didn't want to, like on legit. Like you can tell the guy really loves yeah, the mic. Yeah, he really. Yeah. And I mean, testament to everybody. They were saying that him behind the mic, it's hand and glove. Mm. So uh, I didn't get that part. Did he tell you off air which station he's going to, which station approached him? Oh, I must call him. I'll call him actually. Oh, he didn't tell you. Yeah. Nah, he didn't tell me. Yeah. Tell me. Oh, meant to go. Remember, he's not gonna go. Yeah. Uh, but because of another to. deal that he has that c- does not allow him to be on radio or something like that. He, mm. Yes, because he needs to, or he needs to travel for that. But oh yes, yeah. I think it may have been some Cape. Hey, I don't know. Mm. I'll call him. What do you think of uh, Robert Mara going to nine four seven? I think it's great, man. I yeah. think it's great. Uh. I really think it's dope. Mm. I mean, Rob is, who, he's the best, bro, when it comes yeah. to sports. You know what I mean? Yeah. No one has ever done a sports show and had a, almost like a cult following or had probably almost the same numbers, if not more, than a drive show or a breakfast show on a particular station. And that's the numbers he commands, you know, when he's doing his sports thing. is unmatched. I asked my woman, I'm like, how do you feel about Robert going to 947? She's like, Robert Rimara does radio. I'm like, oh, huh? 2000. <laughs> Oh. What are you doing with the two thousand? <laughs> Rob is a beast. I'm like, hey, hey, hi, hi. But they literally taking like all the best talents from SABC. If yeah, you think but about it, SABC fumbles their talents, mm. don't they? Right? Mm. I mean, they couldn't fucking let me back in just because I had my problems and stuff. Yeah. You know? So they fumble their talents. That's what they do. They fuck up their talents, you know? Look at Fresh, you know, still one of the best in the country. And they let him go over Msuneri. Look at um, f- Rob as well, you know what I mean? So mm. many great, talented people, you know? Tando Tabete, she's good at what she does. She's no longer in that building. Mm. A lot of people, Anelia was in that building. She's no oh, longer yeah, there. Yeah, mm. That's the it's, 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 CZ James. Um, CZ James, mm. right? Yeah. Mm. How, how, he's your friend. What's up with that guy? Like, J- James is his surname. Uh, I think so. We're not like that close. <laughs> He's <laughs> making it sound like I pray with him. <laughs> Are you not crying with James? <laughs> nah, 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 nah. We chat from time to time on WhatsApp, but we're not like close, close, close. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah, he's good. You know what I mean? Like, I mean, SAPC, that's what they do. It's government, you know, run. They, they send, um, what is that policy that the DA was, went to court to try and get ANC to stop um, when they send their caters? Cater mm. deployment. Cater yeah, deployment. it's cater yeah. deployment. It's fucking caters up in there. Of course they're gonna run shit to the ground. Yeah. That's why they can't retain amazing talent. You know, and whatever talent is left there, and there is still some talent, but I don't think they'll keep it for long. And uh, but I mean, hey, ladies and gentlemen, we are back at point. Does it feel good to be back? Black Studios is here, Tuso's here, Fat Shaker's here, Simpiwe is here. Uh, nobody even knows what the sound guy sounds like. <laughs> he called me the other day, I'm like, Simpiwe, is this what you sound like? Because you never even speak on the mic, you know? Yeah, and he's always got a mic in front of him. Why don't you speak on the mic? Do the intro for today. Do the intro there. Give it's him the a, mic there. Do the intro there. It's not my job. All right. Uh, three, <clears throat> two, one, go. In the Armini, we back again. Is that how? Is that how how we do it, right? Marasha, I have a pee pee pee. 
in the army. We back again with another one. Tuso's here, Black Studio's here, Solly's here, Fat Checkers here. Ah, uh, relax now, huh? <laughs> <laughs> but the thing is, with P when you talk about when you talk to him on the phone, he doesn't uh, start him. He doesn't have a stammer. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, but when he has the mic, he, I mean, he starts when you call him on the phone. When he speaks to you just personally, yeah, he's, he starts, he's got a starter, a stammer, they call it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah but when he has the mic, you don't start her. What's up with that? I don't know. You must start him, man. It's good content. <laughs> oh, fuck you. <laughs> Thank goodness you didn't start her. Oh, he, goodness. You put you on the thing to start her. You put you on the yeah. thing on the mic to start her as well, no matter. You're swearing, eh? Oh, dog, but I gotta say, this eye infection, the fucking pits, bro. And hey, you're not gonna believe who I got it from. Where? Uh, Len Muleko. Ooh. And he's in denial of the fucking guy. For real? Yeah. Apparently, it means. <laughs> what does that mean? You saw an old person naked. <laughs> Which old per- Yeah, 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 you agree, right? Yeah, African mythology says. Hey. I think Did I you saw... see any old person naked? No, I saw your future and it's too bright. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Thank you. Who won a lever? I'm tired. I have never heard of that, dog. <laughs> oh, it's it's that. Taz, MILF, that's the problem. Tala Pella spiritually. You're born into Zinsa, a bag of punch. Which category were you watching? Is it pink eye? What is it? Is it pink eye? What is it? Pink eye, pink eye. Oh shit, that shit is highly contagious. Fucked up. That's why I got a sanitizer today. To spray in your does. eyes. How's your sanitizer going to help with the highly no, contagious? with the hands, my Highly man. contagious. <laughs> with the hands, infection. with the hands, chief. Because we went out with Len. When was it, Ghost Lady, when we met Len? Uh, after the last the last time we shot, like uh, there was a Saturday, I think. Yeah, last shot. Yeah. yeah, so we we saw him, and then he was like, he's got some eye thing, whatever. Mm. And on the Sunday, I went out with him, okay. and we we're sharing like cigarettes and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. Then when I woke up, I've got a fucking like my eye swollen. Oh, that's watery. how it started. Yeah, that's right. it started it started with this eye. Now this eye is like coming towards. Yeah, because obviously your it's very. I mean, your eye. Is the closest thing to the other eye. Mm. Yeah. And it's highly contagious. 100%. Mm. So I was like to my woman, oh, wouldn't it be funny if I posted on Twitter right now? Because I had a black, like, you'd swear I was like beaten up or something. Mm. Like my eye was swollen and it was watery and stuff. So I'm like, wouldn't it be funny if I went on Twitter and said, take a picture of my eye and say, hashtag no GPV? <laughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> How? Say, say no to GPV. <laughs> So, so who, who okay. Okay. <laughs> Do you think the feminazis would back me? Like they'd, I'd be in the corner? Nah, they wouldn't. They wouldn't. They nah. They hate you. Nah. The feminazis. No, they believe that you deserve it. Yeah. Yeah, they'd like be like, you got us just desserts. Yeah. Nah. Yeah. I thought about Literally, that. Yeah. Would have been funny though, right? Eh? No. Ah. <laughs> no. And then she also got it as well. So she also had a, like a, a, a blue eye type of vibe thing. And the thing kids well. didn't get it, hopefully. No, no, no. The kids didn't get it. Only it's not painful. It's painful. Uh, not really. It's painful when you put the drops in. Mm. But after that, it wears off. Mm. Yeah, but it's not that painful. That's it's just annoying. Enough. Yes, I can imagine. Itchy? Yeah, yeah. Oh, very itchy. Oh, shit, bro. Oh. Yeah. Hey, bro. Yeah. That sucks. Yeah, no, no, but I'm glad to be back, man. So those glasses, yeah, is it just one of those you buy at clicks or something? No, it's my prescription <laughs> glasses. Cool. I once brought them on the show, remember? That's prescription. Yeah, I remember I told you I read with glasses. Mm. Oh, for real? Yeah, like on my, on my laptop and stuff. You wear glasses. Yeah. You yeah. also, when you watch TV, you wear glasses? Yeah, when I watch TV, I wear glasses as well. Mm. When you fuck? Ah, come on. No. <laughs> when you muff? <laughs> What's wrong with you, dog? <laughs> no, I'm curious. Do you wear your glasses when you fuck? Yeah. Oh, okay. How For real? <laughs> <laughs> Why all of you want want turns? <laughs> Fucking wrong. Yeah, yeah, okay, I do. <laughs> Men are visual like creatures, so normally I fuck with the lights on. So I really prefer seeing everything, you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, like seeing everything, appreciating everything, every part of the body. You know, and yeah. But you so, know her already, even if they're off. You can't, know. Get, can't, can't get enough of her. Oh, okay. But the weird no. thing is some people... Well, were nah, t- to say no look. 
Because <laughs> knows you already, right? No. Right? No look, Baba. No look pass. No look scoring. Because he knows you already, right? No. He can see. <laughs> exactly. So he does, he does have a good look at you, believe yes, it or not. Yes. Or lights off or under the sheets, lights in the dark. He was having old people sex. <laughs> <laughs> old people sex? What yeah, is old? Like, like in the sh- under the sheets, in the dark. I, I, okay, no, I don't think we qualify for old people sex. So why That's are you surprised that I want to see everything? I don't know. Like, I'm just, it's just weird. Don't the glasses get in the way? I'm not fucking with my eyes. <laughs> I don't, okay, I don't know. I don't, I, I don't. I know. fuck. <laughs> I fuck. <laughs> So it's got an eye trick. <laughs> Tell us more. <laughs> trick. Tell us more. It's like how's how's eyes getting in the eye way of sex? No, I'm just saying, like. Don't you just remove your glasses, maybe more saintly, or you just constantly have them on? No, I do sometimes. Like, okay. there are those rounds in the morning, like, you just woke up. Of course, I'm not going to reach for the glasses. Oh, but okay. generally, if you've got a new kitchen, right? Yeah. You start your action in the kitchen, maybe then... They need to test drive it. Chris in the kitchen. Mm. Mm. <laughs> if we've, we've moved around. Mm. In the kitchen. Mm. And? Everything started in the kitchen, they just ended up elsewhere. Hey, hey now. Hey. Mm. <laughs> but the kitchen knows us. Mm. Mm. And now the space in the LARPA. We're no longer shooting in the LARPA, the podcast. Oh, that's been yeah. ages now. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. If that pool could talk, hey. Hey. <laughs> I was reading an article. What do you think is the ideal sex time that every couple should have, like time wise? Um, like 5 a.m. in the morning, 4, 5 a.m. in the morning. No, no, duration, not duration. Not like actual time, but duration. Oh, oh, duration. How long do you think it should last? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'd say 12 minutes. 12 minutes. Well, okay, no, 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 no. Including four play and all, right? Maybe 20 minutes, mm. roughly, yeah. Mm. Mm. But I think you're asking about the sex itself. Right. The intercourse. The intercourse, the intercourse yes. Where now? Intercourse. I think uh, uh, right, about eight, 8 to 12 minutes. 8 to 12, guys? Jeez. Jeez. Is that in the kitchen or in the lava? <laughs> <laughs> yes, <laughs> kitchen or lava. <laughs> uh, so according to this article, the ideal sex time for every couple should be between 10 and 25 minutes. Thank you. Uh-huh. Hmm. And 50% right. cool. of men last only two minutes. Oh. <gasps> Buffet. 50%. Okay, half of you. 50%. For real? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> two minutes. Two minutes, dog. Fucking hell. Yeah. How many? Two minutes. Two minutes. I mean, every guy has had an a, an encounter, right, where they last like maybe two minutes. Oh, right? I've never had. What are you talking about? What do you mean you've never uh, had? Two minutes. What do you mean? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? Uh, I have never. I've never. You have. That's like saying you've never masturbated. What do you mean? You've never? Uh Uh-uh. You have? Two minutes. It happens. Like, and it's not. And also with me, the two minute never happens with a a new encounter, right? It happens sometimes when, let's say, your person, and then they come back and it's Mm. been like a minute. You know what I mean? Yeah. And you're like, (laughs) oh, yes. Tell us. No, no, I don't know. (laughs) Yes, but yo, know, every guy has had the the subpar time. Like the, the first thing you're like, yo, I'm sorry, baby, but you know, you know me, and she and she does know you. You know mm. what I mean? Yeah, it has happened. It has happened, man. I'm just man enough to admit it. it's too good, right? I think that's what you mean. It's just too good, and you haven't had it in a while, right? Yeah. Yeah. Come on, bro. Simpio, mean, you've lasted two minutes. To be honest, uh, yeah. not that it's all, wait, 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 not wait, that wait, you do it all the time, but yeah, yeah. yeah once well, upon a time. What was um, happening? <laughs> nah, man, like, <laughs> like, it's like a girl or, oh, obviously I'm tall. Mm. Yeah, and then, yeah, two minutes, my second round, I, you know. That never happens with me, though. Hey, Rocky. Man, I don't know. That's the problem. Ah. You see? That's the problem. <laughs> oh, privilege. Hey, the phone. Say, you my daughter. Hey, now, have you lasted two minutes? <clears throat> 
Because it's saying 50% of men, so it's 50% of us here. No, but it says 50% on men on average. Yeah, on average, yeah. Minutes. But I think also, when it comes to like, what you call a quickie, you know, a man can also like last for two minutes. Oh, yeah. Consider the sex being quickie, so yeah. And also considering the location, time, yeah. and the adrenaline. Uh, right, yeah. so it's like okay, so Sophie got a school in the manja, like mm, mm, mm. a, a passy, you know, whatever, you know what I mean? but that's intentional, man. Yeah, but that, that doesn't state the condition. It sounds like it's it, not intentional, it t- sounds like it's not a quickie, it's just like on average, yes, like that normal round. No, 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 hence I said, I. It Bro, can be you, intentional because it okay. Like, uh, let me say, let me say this. For instance, as a woman, you'd know your man. You know which positions will make him come faster. Yes, but that's intentional. That yeah, that's yes. intentional. We are talking about now. Everybody here is not talking about the average time. They're talking about it. They oh, lost it. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, okay, cool, cool. A cool, once cool. off encounter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Or, you know, yes, yes. A three times a year encounter out of 346 days of having sex a year. Mm, mm, mm. Okay. Hey, but two minutes is too short, man. Yeah, but it is. We agree. So, how long is a quickie for you? Ah, uh, about 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, sing too late. Let me too late. Let me too late. Let me too late. Let me too late. too late. Let me too late. Sing too late. Anyway, I was saying, so a chiller was out at recharge, and apparently uh, 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 Amaroto were having a fight, dog. Uh, the guys were having a fight. Yeah, oh. and it what? got bad that they didn't even uh, perform on stage. Are you for real? It almost got physical. Ooh. Mm. Are you for real? I kid you not, dog. Why? What's going on between um, uh, Zuma and uh, Thingy? No one knows, but it's funny because when we interviewed them, listen to what they said, listen to this clip. I don't know if you remember this. Um, let me play it for you. Wait, let me stop the song that's playing. Yeah. Uh, we, we did this interview with them, so remember. Listen to what they said, yeah. And then do you guys think you'll ever break up because with most groups, you know, they break up like Jazzy Q. I mean, Jazzy Oh, okay. well, like, uh, well, this thing is, it's a family matter. Oh, this thing is not a problem. It's a process. It's a process, process man. But families fight. Even families break up. I mean, I yeah. fight with Soul like, all the time when we all family. All the fucking time. Yeah. <laughs> but you are still one and I. Ah, not yet. Young <laughs> Swati. <laughs> <laughs> so, so like, <laughs> like recharge. This is spooky. And <laughs> like, hey, but most of the men who start to spend men court really Hey, yeah, yeah. The irony. The irony. <laughs> <laughs> and they were <laughs> They're not a group. They forgot to <laughs> to remember their <laughs> motto. <laughs> recharge. Yeah, it was bad, dog. Small. I don't know. No one knows. Because hmm. hmm. someone told me um, Zuma. It may not be the reason, but it's very close to Bongani Fassi now, apparently. Oh, is it? Mm. Bongs? Yeah. Wow. Zuma. Someone told me. Yeah. Little birdie. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like there's a pun I'm missing. Yeah, ah, no, no, no pun. Ah, yeah, I'm a fake man. It's just like for real. Yeah. But, I mean, together. that may not, it's just some info I have in my head about him. But damn, that's sad, bro. So do you think this is the beginning of the end? Ah, people fight. Aren't they siblings? Siblings always fight. Mm. Are they siblings? No. no oh, they're not siblings? No, 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 no. Oh, they're just friends. They're just friends. Oh, dog. shit. Maybe then it is. You think so? Maybe. Shit happens, dog. Yeah? Shit happens, bro. Come on now. Hey, but they make good music together, bro. They do, bro. Ah, I like who, do you, who do you like between the two more? Uh, I, I like both of them. Is, is just... hey, but they're both fucking suave. And bro, you know what I mean? My man is... Yeah, something else. But I don't, I don't get it, dog. Why do like groups always break up? I mean, we had Black Motion. Now, if these guys break up as well, what's up with groups, man? Podcast and Chill initially broke up. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> Shit happens, bro. <laughs> How? It but, is what it is. But they are here sharing pink eyes, so you know. <laughs> they reconcile. <laughs> ah, that wasn't that was endless. She's working overtime, so we don't shoot the black coffee episode. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Because uh, <laughs> I meant to shoot him uh, last week Friday, yeah. Yes, yeah, true, yeah, true, true, true. Yeah, now yeah. We'll, we'll shoot black coffee. Yeah. He's around. Yeah. What's Tibla, wrong with this uh, mic? Hello, Tibla. Oh, yeah, we're going to ask about your two minutes. 
<laughs> he wants to have his opinion on the two minutes. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Grab the mic. Grab, grab, yeah. Run, my man. We don't have time. Run, G. Time. You're wasting chillers, Tata's here. Uh, with the two minutes thing, it does happen, especially with what Tatu just said. When you think of the girl before she comes to your house and whatever, whatever. So the moment you start doing the deed, I it's shy poisons. Mm. That's it. Ah, too bad. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> you came to shake the mic for that. <laughs> ah, fuck out of here. Dude. Sit down. Go sit down, dog. Sit down. <laughs> oh, it happens, dog. People break up, but all oh, this shit, they've been. Maybe you must call them. Let's call. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, yeah. Let's, Let's call them. Yeah. Let's not call number, Zuma. Yeah. Let's That's rather call. Um. Hey, what's the other one? Reese. Reese Magisa. Let's call Reese, dog. Why do you think uh, groups tend to break up, Ghost Lady? It could be anything. Just. Fallouts. People are bound to argue. You know. Mm, yeah, there's, true. There's, there's just an, a general. It could be money. It could be just because you did this and that. It could be relationships because you are now talking like this to my girlfriend or whoever. Or oh, on the ground, do they both get almost like the same amount of love, or one is deemed bigger, like a Beyonce of the group? Mm. No, nah, I think they get same amount of love. You reckon they get mm. same amount of love? Mm, mm, mm. All right. I think it's egos, man. Egos, bro. Egos, man. Egos, man. Shit, and especially bro, when uh, guys become bigger and bigger, the egos become bigger. That's and then true. one feels like they can do it without the other one. Oh. Yes, you see. Yeah. Oh. Is that what happened with podcast and chill? Nah. <laughs> oh. It's like, he, it's like he's talking from experience. Like he's letting us ah, in into something. Ah, yeah, man. Hi, bo. I'm cute, I'm a chiller also. Yeah, man. yeah. Hey, yeah. yeah, you got this as booga. Oh, shit, oh. I can't connect to the, to the Bluetooth, man. Put him on speaker, man. man. Okay, let me just He'll put him on speaker. He'll make the yeah. things work. Yeah, let me just put him on speaker. Okay, cool. Uh, Whose number do I have? I think I've got Reese. 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 Reese? I don't yeah. know why. Reese it, comes across as the most... Um, Zuma... Yeah, Zuma Marot. I got Zuma. I don't have Reese's number. Most rational. Yeah, Reese is chilled, man. He yeah, Reese. Chilled, Apparently, Reese has released an EP. Yes, Alone. I saw. I saw. Yes. Alone. Yes, I saw that, actually. Good good one. I saw that. Mm, I'm very good clear. One. Welcome to voicemail. Oh, ah. It's on voicemail. It's on voicemail. Let me try again. But I hope they're not breaking up, dog. They got to stay together. Pillars, their time, dog. They're rocking, they bro. For the fact they're that rocking. they didn't even perform. Eh? I'm saying for the fact that they didn't Yeah, it must perform. have been bad. You know yeah. what I mean? Because yeah, they were just hunting. here on that uh, the video you showed us that they said, nah, we can argue, but now we have to do Hispani, you know? We get up on stage and do our thing. Yeah. So for the fact that it ended up like well, they didn't even do Hispani, uh, it's deep. Yeah. That's crazy, man. But I hope it's not true, man. I hope it's not true. I hope they fix their shit together, man. Because those guys are dope, man. Amaroto. Eh? Anyway, what else has been going on, Ghost Lady? Uh, did you guys hear about um, the king of Bacardi who passed on? Uvusi, Ma'ar 5. I saw that Ma'ar 5. Is that, is that, I thought it was my 5 Rand. Is that how you say it? Ma'ar 5? <laughs> I, I, I think it's Ma'ar 5 or my 5 Rand. Isn't an R5? Yeah, like a, a, I know. Uh, Vusi, what happened five. to him? No, he got shots. What? So Shanguve, Pretoria. Yes, sis. Yeah. For what? No one knows. Well, no one knows. You Jeez, know. was he like a big deal? Like, yeah, is he, he big? was. The king of Bacardi. So he started Bacardi? Not necessarily. He was just a vocalist. He was the relevant guy with Bacardi. Yeah. Oh, he was the relevant guy relevant. with Bacardi. What's his popular song? Tenyani. I think... See, let's... Martinez? Yeah, even Martinez. Oh, Martinez, what are your bees? Oh, that's his song. What's the beef? Why did they gun him down? What's going on with Pretoria artists hey. being gunned down? Well, some body, same thing. Huh? The name, does it, what's the name? What does it mean, Mar 5? I think it's just a stage name, ne? Well, it comes from somewhere. I mean, Risa Matlis is inspired by Aries. Zuma, his surname is Zuma. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. It must come from somewhere. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because R5 is a rifle as well, right? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Also. Yeah, it's a gun. Yeah. Mm. Oh, it could be five bucks. Like, <laughs> hey, my, my five rand. <laughs> <laughs> as simple as that. <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, why not? I mean, it could be... Yeah, maybe there's a sentimental meaning. I don't know. It could mean anything. 
Jeez, man. That's sad. Rest in peace to him, man. That's not a nice way to go. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I was at um, I was playing at Kaiser Chiefs the other day during the halftime thing. Oh, nice. Yeah, man. It was dope. Coachella. <laughs> Is that what it's called? <laughs> no. Oh. <laughs> Oh, cow. Cow. <laughs> oh. You're, you made it's it. It's You made it. Did they win that game? <laughs> no, dog. Hey, bro, I love Kaiser Chiefs, but it was terrible. Watching it live is even worse, dog. It's well, like you're playing on bad. FIFA, dog. <laughs> <laughs> it's terrible. For real. PSI hey, is bad, man. dog. You know it was bad, bro. <laughs> My only highlight was meeting and taking a selfie with uh, Jessica. Uh, just come down. Yeah, there's a hot hair on sister. Did you meet her? Both of them. I took a, a selfie with yeah. both of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. She's you mean that Whoa. was the highlight? Yeah, that was the highlight of the evening. <laughs> For real. Uh, shout Jeez. out, dog. Yo, Jessica can get it. Yeah, 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 I was thinking, what's up? Get me, Sonny. Get me, Sonny. Oh, yes, that's the Get name. me, Sonny. Yes, yes, yes. She was the one hosting me. So I was thinking, what type of niggas do you think they date? Like, Didn't one have a thing with Jimmy Tao? And then uh, that's why Jimmy Tao got let go from Chiefs? For real? Yeah, Jimmy. Not Josta. No, Jimmy Tao. It was Jimmy. It was Jimmy Tao. Jimmy Tao. Wow. Jimmy Tao smashed one. Wow. And then they let him go, yeah. So you see. Oh. Yeah. But you wouldn't think they'd go for soccer players because, like, they deal with them all the time. True, right? Mm. Yeah. But, I mean, I, I think, obviously, I talk, but it's, 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 you never know with ladies. Because the thing is, those who, like them who are born into money, wouldn't necessarily have money as a criteria. Especially, sure, exactly. Especially if it's just to like have a thing, mm. either a genuine thing or sometimes just a thing. Money is not a criteria because they already have it. So mm. you can't really impress them with money mm. when they already have the money. Mm. So, And when you're knows? surrounded by men, it's easy to pick one, you know? Oh, because mm. that's who they interact with on a daily exactly. basis. Mm. Exactly. Mm. 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 About to catch Have you ever dated a soccer player, Gosley? No. You've never? No. Soccer player, no. Have you be ever been hit on by one? Mm. No. I didn't even know. No. You don't know the word. Uh, I don't like Gosley. You told me Teko Melissa was in your DMs. Ah, Teko. <laughs> ah, Teko. <laughs> ah, yeah, you, you even corrected him. You said Teko. <laughs> ah, he was. You even corrected him. You even corrected him. You said Teko. You said Teko. Hey, tell us. <laughs> No, no, Something no. you're not telling us. <laughs> but I guess ladies are smashing. You saw uh, Fresh was salivating over her. Hey, Fresh was hitting on everyone. Hey, everything. <laughs> Hit on. Hey, hey. Uh, this one, she heard the spot of Tatos. Hit on her. Hit on her. Hey. Hit, on, <laughs> hit on everything. Hey, hey. I love people out of divorces. Hey, hey. Hitting hit on streets, everyone. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Who you got your money on on uh, the Soweto Derby, dog? There's, a Soweto, there's too many Soweto Derbies, man. There's one coming up, yeah? Is this... There's a Soweto Derby. So what do you mean? I'm a Chiefs supporter. It's obvious. Oh, yeah, yeah. You, Ghost Lady? I'm also a Chiefs supporter, actually. Mm. Speaking of
brand South Africa. They want to advertise South African tourism on the Tottenham jerseys. Lindio Sisulu wants to spend a billion a rand. A billion fucking rands. Wow. You didn't hear about that? No, I didn't know. Gee. Like, how about we fix the electricity? What's the Guys. point of tourists coming and there's no electricity? It's like we're back to the flag rubbish now. Yes, exactly. Like, it's like there's no pocket that hasn't been looted enough. Like, what's the point of that? Our country's in shambles to be advertising it to begin with. You know what I mean? Like, Okay, for tourism, you want to invite people to visit South Africa to what? Darkness. There's no electricity. There's crime. Like, crime is crazy. Every day, Yusuf Abramji, whatever his name is, is He's saying cash in transit here, oh, and yeah. there, here and there, here and there. And then we want to spend a billion to support what? Tottenham? Tourism. To sp- sponsor Tottenham's jersey? We need to fix the country first, guys. Like, spend that money with, on the country, here. Yeah, man, that's, uh, that's, that's, uh, uh, that's just absurd. That's These guys crazy. are so out of touch, dog. How do you spend a billion on Tottenham out of all teams? Them, dog. Yeah. So actually, it seems like this article is, is it's false, eh? What? Wait. Like, that statement about the spending a billion rand. So, oh, for real? Yeah. It's 100 million. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> no, no. So I think, um, is it the department? They they wrote a statement saying that um, that uh, that was never meant to happen. So the Daily Maverick, because I saw that on the Daily Maverick website. Uh-huh. So they say the Daily Maverick is bullshitting. Yes. Because my source is the Daily Maverick. Yes. So say, sadly, this article is riddled with inaccuracies and untruths aimed at tra- uh, tarnishing Minister Sisulu's image. There is no Maver- doubt the report seeks to drive a political agenda rather than to inform the public truthfully in the line of gen- uh, journalism ethos. What? So what's the truth? What's so the that's truth? The, it's a whole, it's a whole, like I'm just trying to find... What exactly are they trying to deny? Hey, There's man, no way listen. the Daily Maverick would do that. Yo, mm-hmm. listen. Daily Maverick. Public concern bills as Lindua Susulu confirms Spurs deal is on the table. But they're the bottom of the table. But denies <laughs> championing it. So she accepts it. She so- confirms it, but denies championing it. Following Daily Maverick's reporting on SA Tourism's plan to spend nearly a billion sponsoring Tottenham Hotspur, the Minister of Tourism has confirmed that a proposal is on the table. A statement angrily denied that Lindua Sisulu herself had any personal interest in the deal. Meanwhile, public concerns over the expenditure is building. So there is a deal from the department, but she may not be championing it, which I don't know how, if she's the minister. Yeah. Fact checker. Um, what you just stated is true, and it has been confirmed by three sources. What Saul just stated, oh, there is a deal on the table. Mm. News 24 has covered it. IOL has covered it. Mm. And the Daily Maverick has also covered it. But this is a statement from the Department of um, to, uh, Tourism. The last statement that I see in regards to the Department of Tourism is one that was released on the 19th of May, 2022. Who are you going to believe, Ghost Lady? Are you going to believe Department of Tourism or IOL? Ah, man. Uh, 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 Daily, uh, Maverick. Daily Maverick. Who are you going to believe? Come on now. Highly. Come on yeah. now. Come on now. But maybe, it's, you see, maybe they're denying a certain part, but obviously some parts are true. Nah, where well, they smoke, there's fire, maybe man. Maybe she's not champion. This is something like yeah. the, something they would do, bro. It's, yeah, it's, it's so like out of touch. Mm. Because it, it sounds says, like looting. It sounds like her, like just... Bro, our country's in shambles. We have no business. Let's close the country and fix it and then market the country out there for people to come visit. We don't even have electricity for 12 hours straight. Hmm. How are you inviting tour- tourists to do what? To sit and in the dark. To sit in the dark. Yeah, spending a billion on a football team that doesn't even win anything. <laughs> it's hot in them. <laughs> anything else you got, Coach Lady? Um, so for instance, uh, another one was Sir Trill, guys. Oh, Did you I saw that statement? today. Yeah, yeah we're recording yeah. this on Wednesday. Yeah. Yeah. Yesterday. Yeah. So he's Which literally just speaking today. out and um, there's a post that he said, he said, it's, it's tiring and mentally damaging. So many hits and I've never seen a cent. I'm tired. And never been an artist that talks much or exposes much. This will definitely be a joke to some of y'all. Which I understand, but it's mentally damaging and exhausting. 
what are we working for so much? How's he not making money? That makes no sense to me, bro. My question is, who's responsible for Sir Chill's paperwork? Because mm. obviously, by no sense, he's talking about royalties. He's not talking about gigs. He's always gigging, we know. Yeah, yeah. And I mean, that gets... But doesn't he make money from that? Yeah, yeah true. Way, most artists make money. Yeah, yeah true, But the way but he's complaining, it sounds like this guy is like literally not getting a cent. Nah. So it's 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 the gigs is fine. Gigs it's just royalties. Yes, royalties oh, okay. and whatever. If his songs are in sync deals and stuff, then my question is who is handling his paperwork and on all those hits, who is responsible for the paperwork? Mm-hmm. Because it's through the paperwork that it is known that okay. He owns 50% of the song because he wrote all the lyrics. Remember, there's also the composer or composers. Yeah. It's a piano song. It could be more. Yeah, because so. the split sheet for, for, for Ngantini, everybody's there. Everybody's name's there. So Trill is there. Uh, the producers are there. So why Who is he? Who else is there? Who else is there? That's it. Oh. So why? Yeah. Why is he? If he's there. So you're going to say, yeah, there. Yeah, I'm there, sir. How? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I put my name on it. So, so you got what the percentage money? is putting your name on it? Uh, I got like ten percent. Okay, now cause, yeah, because because of you the song blows up. Yeah. Right. Yeah. If yeah. it wasn't you pushing the song, yeah. and your fans, yeah. fair enough. So you made you made a contribution, maybe not to the creation of it, but to the blowing up of it. Yeah. So the guys will give up ten percent. Yeah. That's fine. It's and I, and I bought agreement. the song as well. Oh damn! For real? How much mm. you bought it for? I think ten k. For real? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Ten, oh, you bought the years. rights to use your to put your name on it, not bought yeah. it and you own it. No, no, no. Whatever no. you put. No, 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 no. Oh, oh you bought po- you bought into the song. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's it's a fair deal. It's mm. like you invested in the song. Okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. Damn, but did man, you get not... your share? Did you get your cut? Of what? The royalty yeah, side. Ah, I mean, ah, I don't know, yeah, so yeah, maybe then he's um he's ah, No, search was good songs from like Three years ago. Yeah, that when piano was still like the first big Yeah, because yeah, now the headlines are gonna be Mac G didn't pick Sentry <laughs> from Canteen. You quickly said, No, I got my money. <laughs> I know. <laughs> man, I still haven't had royalties from songs that released like years ago, man. Are you for real? Yeah. Like... Are you registering with Sam, bro? Did you register the songs? Did you notify Sam, bro, of the new works? No, no, you must I'm notify sure. them of your works. I'm not sure, man. But my old songs didn't do well, so I mean, it's like nothing. What did they bro. get radio airplay? Because Sam, bro, yeah, yeah. what they will do is, if you, you've never been on Sam, bro, and you have a song, it, it does well. Two years later, back in the days, I don't know now. Um, you'll get something from those songs. It will take a while, yeah. right? Because you go to Sambro, you register, but you don't just get payouts. They need to see if, because every Tom, Dick, and Harry thinks they can make music, mm. and then their songs they don't get airplay or sure. anything, sure, sure. or any rotation yeah. anyway, then Sambro. So Sambro will only take you as a member when you've proven that you've got works and your works actually do play on radio it doesn't have to be like a million times mm. and then they'll start paying you mm. um, so you should have been paid if you registered with Sambro if your music got some form of airplay yeah. I mean I had songs back then yeah. you know and I, I used to get paid from how much Sambro. did you get paid? I don't know I think I've sp- I've mentioned about, like when I, I left I don't know a lot. Royalties is not a lot of money. Yeah. But I didn't have a super hit. That's the thing. I remember when I went to the Big Brother house and I, I came out and checked my bank account. Because mm. when you don't win, that's the first thing you do. Mm. You know, to see what how poor you are. <laughs> <laughs> and the server paid me like 30 grand or something. Oh. And, that was, and that was like for Uhuru. So, you know, I was decent. Yeah. Um, no. Was that the only payment you ever got? No, I didn't get payments. Till today, I get payments. Mm. Like with Samro. Mm. Like Mutwering and them show love, they play my music. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Things, even after the podcast, when my name started being like, oh, yeah, we remember him. People now playing my So it's the weirdest thing ever. Oh, nice. So I still get paid, yeah. Oh, dope, man. Oh. But the, it's like you'll get like five grands, three grands. That's you know, it's money, not a lot. So that's money. But you can imagine if you've got big songs like Sir Trill. Exactly. Yeah. Then you should be getting paid serious money. Oh. And you can't even call him because the guy doesn't like talking that much. He doesn't like interviews. He's a ghost. Like, literally, his album is called Ghost. Mm. He's a ghost. Like, Trill's a ghost, man. You can't just get a hold of Sir Trill. Who are you? I'm fond of him. I'm cool with him. I don't even know. I have his number. 
You know? I did a song with him, I didn't even have his number. Oh, wow. You, you were lucky to get him to, to your video, yeah. to your music video. You were even lucky to get him to your music video. Yeah. It's just that guy, man. Troll is just t- troll. Yeah. Anyway, you can place a bet on Tic Tac Bets. Uh, any it. bet. <laughs> yeah, I finally found it. <laughs> any PSL game from a minimum bet of 50 rands or more. Uh, from the 30th of January to the 20th of Feb, and stand a chance to win four VIP tickets to the Soweto Derby. Uh, disclaimer Tic Tac Bets is not only a licensed bookmaker, but a brand that is also concerned about your well being. It is by law only uh, for 18 years uh, and older uh, are permitted to gamble. Winners, as we say at Tic Tac Bets, we advise you, you must know when to stop. So if you need help, kindly call Counseling Help Free Line on 0800-006-008. That's 0800-006-008. Tic Tac Bats. Kelsor. Yeah. What else you got, Ghost Lady? Uh, shout out to Anelis Sun. Yeah. So the kid got nominated for I like it. Yeah, I like it. At the Nickelodeon Kids Choice Awards. Oh, wow. And it's for the category Fave African Kid Influencer. Wow, he's an influencer. He's an influencer. Damn. Damn, he's an influencer. Man. And he's so That's, young. He's got his own account now, I'm sure on Instagram and Twitter yeah, sure, and stuff. I think, I think. Maybe not Twitter, but Instagram. Yeah. yeah I think oh, so. shout out to the kid, man. Like, what does he do? <laughs> By the time she retires, Hamilton. By the time she retires, he'll take over her show. <laughs> <laughs> it's a family business. It's a family oh. business. <laughs> he also has a YouTube channel, so yeah. I oh yes, so. he, is, he does, so. and I've, I've seen him speak to a couple of uh, Formula One drivers. No, incredible so kid. Cute. Would you let your kid do that, like be an influencer? Yeah, if there's money to be made. You reckon? Why not? Mm. Um, up until they're old enough to decide what they want to do. Because it's easy to just walk away, delete the whole thing, and nobody ever... Like, imagine if I like he turns 12, and by the age of 15, I bump into him at a mall. I wouldn't, I wouldn't even know it's him. Mm. You know what I mean? Um, so, yeah, I would. I mean, if there's, you can... If, if she wants to... And she's aware of what she's doing. And I think Alak is very much aware mm. that he's recording videos and stuff. Yeah, why not? Hmm, I don't know, man. I was a child star and it's not nice, bro. Like, in hindsight. Because you never get to be a kid. Because, like, every weekend I was shooting inserts, recording this. So you never actually get to be a kid. Shit, for real. Yeah. Maybe that's why I'm still stuck in my 13-year-old body. My 13 year old hey, mind. <laughs> hey, watch out. Hey, whoa. I've whoa. never grown. Watch out. <laughs> For real, though, it's not nice because us not going like Enki and we're seeing, you know, Mandy, Sas, Piwe, yeah. uh, what's the other one? Carly, Shade, Mac G. Okay, you well, maybe I, after I was a bit older. I'll speak for myself. It wasn't nice because literally, dog, it's school Monday to Friday, ne? Mm-hmm. and then Saturday and Sunday you shoot. And we talk about long hours, dog. In one day you could do like seven episodes, right? Mm. So you're literally in studio from 9 until 5 p.m. You go home, you sleep, you're back in That's studio crazy. on Sunday. Monday is back to work. So you don't even have friends. You don't socialize. Okay. You don't do normal things that normal kids do. So who took you to the audition? Your mom? Yeah, yeah. Did you say, Mom, I want to be on TV? Yeah. Oh, then. Ah, then but you were a kid, you right? asked for it. <laughs> but you, you chose. asked for it. So, because there's moms out there who are like, cute kid. So how do I get my mom and my kid on TV? Yeah. I'm sure you get that a lot, right? I'm like, I don't know. And then they go find a casting agency and then you just take the kid without the kid's consent. Yeah. And they, But at least when you want to do it on TV. Yeah, no, I saw the TV kids. I'm like, I want to do this. Uh, and then the next day, my mom told me where to go. Then I got, in, I got into a taxi, went to Santon. The, the, the headquarters of ETVs were, were at Santon at the time. You were not a child star. Ah, you even took a taxi. I know. This is before. What do you mean? Yeah, but if you're old enough to take a taxi. You're not even a kid. Oh, I was, so I was 13. Uh, uh, oh, no, we're talking here about babies. You know, like how you decide, like, okay, I want to take my babies to be uh, watch, watch, to for, for maybe nappies. You you're know? in grade seven. Oh, was I an adult then? Yes. Oh, come well, on. No, you're not an you're adult. You're in grade seven, bro. Some people, there's someone. You're in high school. Who had not I wasn't in high school, by man. 13. Hey, Look what, at all these ants. What, what happened? Hi! 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 What happened? I missed that word. Hi! What happened? No, I said, who had lost their virginity by 13? And I said, Look at all these ants. And everybody was just staring at me like, like, like Look at all these ants. Okay, fair enough. 
you're still a baby. Though. But you asked Let's for it, honest. though. You I, asked for it. Yeah. So I walked to Santon mm-hmm. ETV. Uh, met. Oh, what's the guy's name? I'll never. Some Indian guy. And I like. I want to be on TV. And that same day, they took me to Red Pepper, and I did auditions with Salamina. And then yeah. I started on Monday. And then who made it through? What do you mean? Oh, she, you both made the show. Oh, she was already on the show. She was already there. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I did an audition with her on Saturday, and then on Monday I started. Brilliant. Man. Yeah. And how was the money? Ah, it wasn't a lot, dog. It was like 800 per call. Jeez. Back then, but that's a long time ago, bro. Damn, bro. This is like 2002, 2000, somewhere there. Okay. Yeah. I can't now. I don't know if that was a lot or what. But nah, it wasn't a lot. What did you do with that? Was it enough to do anything substantial? I bought a PC with my first paycheck. Oh. And then I bought my mom a car and then the rest she... You bought oh. your mom a car? <laughs> hey. I thought you bought your mom... I thought you bought your mom a car with the 947 money. No, I bought a second car with the 947 money. What's the first car you bought your mom? Corolla. The one she would take me to work with. Oh, that cream Corolla. That ah, it was maroon. I crashed it. Oh, shit. Yeah, it was the maroon one. Oh, then at least, man, you know. But then after that, I don't know what she did with the money because she said, I think I should handle your money. Got okay. She was a mom, man. She Mm. deserved all Mm. of it, Mm. really. Mm. She raised you single handedly. She rocked me, yeah. (laughs) (laughs) I manage her, say. I'm on my pink eye, (laughs) Bella. (laughs) We'll get another one. Be careful. (laughs) Bro, I think I'm feeling your pink eye. (laughs) (laughs) Did you sanitize? No, man. Sanitize, dog. Sanitize. How is this going to help with not getting the thing in my eye? <laughs> so only if like if we have if we touched and you touch your eye then you might get it. But other than that you're good. All right, okay, I haven't touched my eye. Yeah, I haven't touched you at all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Why do you touch me? Yeah, but we're not <laughs> we want you to start with a pink eye. <laughs> Yes, Fick Chaka, we see your hand. Um, I just wanted to state that Alakim Dotta is not the only South African kid influencer to be nominated. Also, Ritabile Mahata and Siba um, Bohopa, JR Sun and DJ Arch Jr. JR Sun? Oh. Yes. Wow, he's an influence. This is a thing, bro. JR Sun. Oh, Bohopa, yeah, JR Sun. Yes, you should know, because late. <laughs> Jair son, you have history. <laughs> Mother-in-law. <laughs> Godmother. Ghost mother. Mother ghost. Oh, oh. Anyway, anything yeah, else you want to talk about, Doc? Yeah, man, I got a text. Um, Two things. Mm. I got a text. Remember uh, that guy from Stellenbosch who uh, the white kid urinated on his belongings? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Yeah, and we spoke to the father. The father texted me. How's it, Saul? You may have forgotten me, which I didn't because he always views my statuses. How's it, Saul? <laughs> you may have forgotten me, but I'm the father of the boy whose belongings uh, were urinated on by the white racist cunt. Mm. I've just got information that the boy has been enrolled at Academia University. It's an Afrikaans university, by the mm. way, if you Google it, right? Um, I think got kicked uh, 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 out of uh, Stellenbosch for the racism thing. Stellenbosch probably sent the referral, probably, which is run by Solidarity Party. I think it's Solidarity Union or, or whatever, but he says Solidarity Party because I'm just reading as he sent it. In the meantime, there are processes to, fr- to frustrate my son's progress at Stellenbosch. So Stellenbosch is frustrating the kid, and they're not making him stay there any smooth. Mm. I'd appreciate a minute you mentioning my plight against the systemic racism. Mm. Aye, aye, aye. Welcome to South Africa. Just now, now, what's his name? Um, Pristorius. Uh, what's that other racist cunt's name? I'll I'll get it. I'll get it. I'll get it. Corey okay. Pretorius. Yeah. I'm assuming Corey Pretorius. Remember the guy who went viral with a gun kicking a black kid? Mm, 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 mm. Who was like 15, 16, mm. and he, he, with a gun in his hand? Mm. Yeah, he got uh, found guilty, but um, he was give, he was sentenced to 12 months in prison or 12,000 rands fine. Can you imagine? 12,000 12, rands. 12,000 rand 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 For kicking... Stomping, smacking a black kid as a white male in South Africa. 12,000 rand fine on African soil. Huh. 
And then now this, this other kid urinated in, you know, that's crimin injeria right there. But are well, you shocked? Are you shocked? This happens all the shocked. time, I'm dog. disgusted. Mm. It happens all the time, but we mustn't be okay with it. Mm. Mm. You know what I mean? Mm. So there he goes. The kid is in now academia university. EFF, do something, man, you know? Yeah, they do love this yeah, stuff. EFF, oh, they, <laughs> they've got a hard all right now. <laughs> EFF have got a, the biggest hard all right now. And we appreciate it, you know? Yeah, yeah. I think really EFF has got, you know, uh, 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 it makes these kind of things um, it, it it gives the much needed spotlight. Uh, Are you gonna join the national shutdown? When is it? Twentieth uh, of March, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, so I skip the March. national. Is it twentieth of March? Somewhere there. It's in March, though. What am I required to do? Are we gonna join it? Are we gonna not record on that day? <laughs> <laughs> Look at you looking for an excuse not to joke. <laughs> hey, <I will> <laughs> hey, Chillers, should we join the national shutdown? Yeah, yeah. You decide. <laughs> <laughs> but you know how I feel about protests, man. We're going to protest and do what? Load shit is not going to go away. Yeah, true. What's the point of a national shutdown if election time, everybody shows up for the ANC? Mm. I think the best thing to do is uh, get some brilliant minds in that field, in a room together, and we find a solution. Yeah, but they don't want to do that. I mean, yeah. that's We could do that. I mean, we've got amazing minds in this country. Yeah. They can solve this thing. I'm sure there's a chill out there who can solve this thing. Yeah, well, and it's not even like a hectic brains, bro. Just maintain... Uh, 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 the the stations, you know, the power stations. No, no, like finding alternatives, not depending on the government. Like oh. us as people finding alternatives to this ESCOM thing. Yeah, if the law would allow it, if there were to be other uh, power producers and who could sell just power and to the public, I'm pretty sure. Why don't we do a people... podcast, bro? Like a roundtable podcast with some engineers and th- throw out some ideas. Yeah, that's a great idea. That's our little contribution. Mm. I like that. Mm. Let's do that. You know what? If you're a chiller and you know and you think you've got this load shedding thing figured out and you've got the solution, drop us an email. Let's do a roundtable with a bunch of engineers and see, like, what can be done, man. Yeah. Like, what did Oranya do? Because they're off the grid. Oranya? Yeah, they're off the grid, dog. Fuck Oranya. Oh, they got electricity. <laughs> Fuck the <laughs> wall. Fuck them in the light, under the lights. <laughs> Shit, Oranya, fucking hell. Why do we even have that thing in this country? Yeah. You know? oh, Oranya can't be made an example of anything exactly. great, man. It's a whole exactly. racist thing that they have going on there. Excluding. No, but you, you got to respect the mentality. They're not like us, me and you, we sit here uh, whining about load shedding week in, week out, but doing nothing. So they sat together, they're like, all right, cool. There's this thing happening, what do we do? And they came up with a solution. So why can't we do the same? Yeah, oh yeah, but we can't say shout out to Oranya. Yeah, we can't. I mean, they no example, man. It's Oranya, bro. <laughs> Come on. It's Oranya, man. It's, it's privilege. It priv- it, yeah, nah, privilege apart from that, else. nah, man. Screw Oranya. But, yeah, you know, they've got electricity. Mm. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I, I, I can feel I'm getting cancelled, yeah. <laughs> no. I'm no, you're not. No. no, no, but no. the thing is, it's uh, we, we. they can't be the, you know, example of greatness, mm. to be honest. No, I'm not saying that. And also, they're the great, how many of them are there? How many thousands of people are there in yeah. the Oranje? You know? So, like, it's five million people they're no. providing electricity. Dog, I'm not talking about they're great. I'm not saying they're great. I'm saying you gotta admire their mentality. No. You don't? No. Wow. Okay. I, I, wow, guys. Okay. Okay. So the, is this similar to Penuel now, the black pen with Afroforum thing? That because you no no it's similar it's, it's, that you got it's, it's similar to Afro- what it's similar to what Penn said about uh, Hitler. Penn says about Hitler. Yes, he must go back to that episode. He said no, like I don't agree with the things he did, mm. but there's some things that you know I do agree with. The positives that you take from. Yeah. 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 Uh huh. 
not to say he's glorifying the man mm-hmm. and he's saying the man is great, but he's saying there's some ideologies which were, when I sit down, I'm like, actually, that kind of makes sense. Okay, fair enough. Yeah. Fair enough. I get that. Hi. <laughs> 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 throw me under the bus, man. No, no, I didn't throw you under. You threw yourself, nigga. No. Hey, I man. can see the headlines tomorrow. Make G supposed to run. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, on a lighter note, Chava's album. Oh, yo, yo, yo. Chava is a gold mine. Fucking yeah. hell. Yo, favorite song? No, I haven't listened to it yet. I haven't. There's a song. I just saw a lot of quotes. There's a song. Is it Benga Bengazi? But ah, that's not proper Zulu. Ngangazi, Nganga. Track track three, track three. Yeah. Brilliant, bro. So he starts off the song, right? Mm. And he's singing from the point of view of a girl who's impregnated by a guy, and. She tells her parents, because eventually it's going to show that, listen, I'm pregnant. And they're dismayed and disappointed. And this girl now raises this kid. But she he's singing in first person as this girl, you know. Bengas. Mm. I wasn't going to give him my virginity. Mm. That's the chorus. Second verse, it comes. And now he's singing. Uh, I'm still from uh, 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 the thing of the girl, you know, the point of view of the girl as the girl. And then mid-verse, he changes to the mother of the girl. Wow. And then he's saying about how this girl doesn't, she, the mother's asking the girl, who are you going to get married? And there's no mkwinyane. And the girl is sleeping around with men because she's trying to get the, the, father, the love she didn't get from, from her father. father. Yeah. And those are the girls we are calling, you know, all sorts of names out there because I've got father issues. Issues, yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah. And the whole song is about that. Niggas must fucking raise their fucking daughters. Oh, beautiful. You know? Yeah, fucking great. Then there's EPC. E- e- he, he has two songs named Peace. One is in English. Peace. What if the girl just likes things? I... Nah. And, and be well, allowed. And be allowed to like things. Nah. But it's from a deep rooted pain and the absence. Yeah. Man, it's, just, it's a fucking. Uh, sometimes it's not that deep, dog. Sometimes these girls just like things, bro. Nah, dog, there's... Yeah, fair enough. If she grew up fine with daddy, daddy who really loved her and everything, and a stable home, a fine uh, 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 family background that is stable, then maybe she just likes things. But if she grew up with all that trauma, or if even if he, a guy, grew up with all the trauma and it turns out fucked up, Look, I know some people grow up with trauma and they turn out just fine. But mm. not everybody's the same, mm. you know? Mm. But it's a fucking brilliant album. Yeah, no, it sounds, it sounds... It's gold, bro. It's fucking beautiful. It's 18 it's... tracks, ne? I think 18 tracks. Jesus, it's gold. 18 tracks, man. Yeah. Gold. I just saw everybody going crazy about his pen game. Apparently, it's lit. Yeah. yeah, it's lit, bro. So I met him, right? So I bumped into Java last week. Um, and he showed me a broken mirror. And he's like, actually, I named this song, uh, this album, because of this mirror. So he bought a mirror. And he was walking up uh, to his place. And uh, the mirror fell by the stairs and it got broken. And he kept on using that broken mirror oh, wow. for like a year and stuff. Like, literally, that was his mirror. And that's, Isbugo means mirror. Even the artwork. Even the artwork, it's a broken mirror. Oh, shit. Oh, gold mine. Yeah. Mm. Even the ladies on Mazama can't finish it. <laughs> so I can't undermine it. <laughs> what did you think, Ghost Lady? Did you like it? No, I just saw a lot of like quotes that people were saying. So I have not listened to the, you know, but I. You haven't. Yeah. You're going to appreciate it because you're yeah, super also. The way exactly. Yeah. His pen game is time. with his language. Mm-hmm. Yeah, man. Yeah. It's beautiful, bro. I saw some beautiful Java's songs. incredible album. T- well, the opening song is just, it's a prayer. Mm. It's fucking amazing. Java is just, that's amazing, man. Yeah, I know the guy's amazing. What happened to this interview? We dropped it for members only. Yeah, I think we dropped it for members only. Um, should I drop it again for members? Let's invite him again. Yeah, let's invite him again. To come yeah, I bet it was amazing, man. Yo, if you're a member and you checked it out, wow. It was beautiful. I went to his house. Like, just a simple guy. You can tell, like, he doesn't have any superstar vibes. He stays on top of North Cliff, I think. He oversees Joburg. Very simple guy. I used to stay in a hostel. Very simple Yeah, guy. and his house is like a hostel. It's a one-bedroom. He's just got a bed there. His sneakers, his, his, his clothes and stuff. The kitchen. They use those mugs. You know, like the ones we use at the Red Cherry Studios? Enamel. The enamel mm, mug. Yeah, yeah we use mugs. that. He, chilled, nigga, dog. We, we chilled for, like, five hours. That was so chilled, bro. Yeah. So fucked. And the reason why I got the interview, he thought, I was the other Mac G, the fashion Mac G. Oh, so the, oh, the one, it's part of two bunnies now, that guy. You know, two bunnies? Yeah. 
You don't know two bunnies. Uh, the piano uh, guys. Yeah, the ones who wear the things. I think. Oh, Mac G's part of them. I think Mac G. There's a Mac G there. I heard. Yeah. yeah. There's a Mac G's part of them, ne? And his brother. So he's not oh, in the profession. No, his brothers. No, he's not in. Well, maybe he is because they dress nice as well. But and it looks like he probably designs the stuff. Oh. But yeah, um, piano now. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Podcast next. <laughs> In that order. In that, that order. order. <laughs> Fashion piano podcasting. Make G waiting for you, man. Drop the podcast. Wow. Oh, so wait. Strava thought he, you are Make G. Yes. Yeah, so he didn't know the, about you. No, he didn't know. For real. So that's the only reason he agreed to do the podcast. And then the, the whole ladies of our thing happened. He's like, ah, please don't drop it. I was like, ah, cool. No stress, my G. Well, was it something about? Regarding the ladies of my yeah, 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 yeah. I got him to open up and he didn't like where I took him. <laughs> <laughs> How's he gonna come now? I got him to open up. <laughs> uh, speaking about members, uh, our vendor trip behind the scenes, there's a vlog that's up for patrons and members. If you want to check out what happened in the vendor trip, have you guys seen the vlog? No, I've uh-uh. not seen. Oh, you're not a member? Uh-huh. We, we, are, we member. are members oh, Why didn't you get it? We're honorary members We got it But we don't <laughs> watch this stuff yeah. I mean How? We don't like Oh, oh. We were there you know? We were there We are the behind the scenes We were there bro <laughs> So it reveals everything Behind the scenes Yeah the, the, the stuff that Tabang shot Like on the way there And when nice. we got to the lodge Yeah yeah, we went out to party when you were sleeping, when you and some people were sleeping. Yeah, yeah, because we were I driving back too. the following day. We also day. went to bed. Right? You, oh, yeah, yeah, you yeah. also went to bed. Hey, but that night was nice, bro. No, I saw that video no, and I was like, oh, shit, I should have gone. <laughs> it looked For very real. Nice. Yeah, it was dope. We left in the morning, man. I was lit. In the club? Yeah. Don't, yeah, you guys came dope, back dope. like 5 a.m. It next. just didn't look like there was a popping club. Oh, we bro, we went to the most popping club there, Yeah, bro. I know. Because we were not that place where it was just men... <laughs> well, 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 I bought the the Jaeger. I didn't even finish it. No, no. Wait, that's a tough the fake dog. Jaeger. That's oh, a fake Jaeger. Bit. You got fake Jaeger, ne? Yeah, yeah, I got fake Jaeger. I, I was like, this is not Jaeger. Oh, man, why? Why? Yeah, like, there's no tavens in Fosla. What's wrong with you, man? That they was sell, a tavern. They sell better Jaeger. They sell original Jaeger. <laughs> no, so you got, you got four Jaeger. You Jaeger. got four Jaeger. <laughs> What's wrong with you, dog? Yeah? You got four Jaeger. Huh? Four Jaeger. Four, 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 four Jaeger. Four Jaeger. Four Jaeger. Four Jaeger. Four Jaeger. And it was Neo's birthday, so Tibla bought a, a, a bottle of Granger. Oh. Yeah. oh, shit. So that's how you know it was popping. Yay. Wow. Yeah. Wait, you uh, bought a bottle of Granger. Oh, 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 oh that Chillers Club. Yes. That's the club I thought you owned. Owned. Yes. What's his name? Chiller something. Chilla. The only chiller. Yeah, something. The only like chillers. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Huh? Chiller's exclusive. Chiller's exclusive. Cat must ended up playing. Hey, my man, Rosa Five. For real. Fat check and anthem. Yo, yo, yo. Hold on, hold on. Quick one, quick one, quick one. Speaking of, <laughs> that morning, Tabang. Oh. <laughs> Really? Was crying for his life. Really? Like, I don't want to die, son. I don't want to die. <laughs> and your boy Jigga was trying to kill Tabang. Really? What really? happened? Really? You were talking about really? Really? Son, I don't want to die. I'm not going to relax. I'm not going to kill you. What did I do? Like, you were trying to kill me. What happened, dog? Uh, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Do the members The members are going to see this. Yeah the members will see what happened I'm his bags in my They're car They're not going to see what happened Because it's Tabang Who shot the band hey! And he definitely Yo. Didn't shoot himself Yo. So, so what, what happened is Tabang He got drunk This is what I heard um, So apparently Because we were always sleeping In separate rooms um, And then um, Koketo Cat's woman Mm-hmm. And Jigger's woman We were all sleeping in one room Okay So Tabang I don't know what happened But after he fetched the condom from uh, Fat Checker He yeah. went into Coquette so Condom Fat Checker had condoms Yeah Okay Yeah And he had one And then uh, one. And then Tabang Apparently went into Coquette so And Jigger's woman's room Right And then when they woke up He was in the middle there Passed out So they were passed out as well They don't know what happened where was the condom? No one knows. Oh. So who wanted to kill Tava? Chiga. Hey. Why not Cat? Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, for real. Coquetto and Chiga's woman are sleeping in the same room. Are you not listening? 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. But only the one nigga's man, the one woman's oh. man, wanted to kill him. Ah, oh, my so, man. People act very differently. I don't know. So, who was kept? Who was Tavan gonna use the condom on? We don't know. Who's he saying he was gonna use the condom? He doesn't know as well. He was fucking pop drunk. He doesn't know why. He doesn't even remember getting in the to get. Condom. He doesn't remember how he got in there. Mm. Shit. Hey. It was a mess. That's bad. <laughs> Are you happy now? Let's Are we done with the story now? Yeah. Are you happy? Okay. What else do you wanna know? Now I understand. What, what underwear was he wearing? <laughs> nah, yeah. come on. Hey man. Shame, it felt, felt very bad. Yeah, it did. Yeah. Let's Tabang. call Tabang actually. Let's did ask he? him what happened. Okay, let's call him. Let's call Why did he feel yeah. bad? No, because he also didn't understand what happened, you know. He was be- he had asked, he wanted to leave with us because he felt like he was going to be judged, you know, in the by the gang. But he what? Is Jigger with the gang. I mean, wouldn't you be pissed if some guy that you don't know, because Jigger doesn't work for the podcast, so he doesn't know Tabang. If some guy is just there sleeping next to your woman with a condom on, <laughs> wouldn't you be mad? At who? Wait, he was wearing the condom? You no, know, I don't know, I'm just saying. <laughs> no, but why is Jigger mad? Okay, fair enough. I will be mad. Yeah. But, okay, maybe he had a talking to to his woman as well. Like also Spice's story now. And this nigga sleeping with a condom on. <laughs> and then you was here to ask where was the condom, yeah. remember, right? <laughs> I asked him. Let's go, Tava. Shop boy. Hey, Poison Ukraine. Ah, uh, good, man. How are you? Easy, man. You're live on the podcast. Ghost Lady is here. Soul is here, yeah? What's up, bro? Hey, hey, what's shots. happening? <laughs> so hey, everybody, hey, 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 guys. everybody wants to know what happened in, in Vanda, dog, according to you. Do you guys want to murder well, that... <laughs> well, you guys, you want me to tell the full story? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay, uh, so so I, I need to go in Vanda, right? Yeah. So, and then what happened was I was chilling with... Okay, we went to the party, right? Yeah, the party, that, that little party, lit, yeah. got lit. Yeah. yeah, yeah, the party was lit, the party was nice. And then we went to, uh, what's this, uh, the, the, the place we were sleeping at, right? Mm. And then, I was still with Boosie, right? And then, oh, you call that what Boofy? happened was... No! Boosie. Boosie, Boosie fact, fact checker. checker. Oh, you have, oh, sorry, yeah. your name, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, essentially, I was still with Boosie, and then we chose something like, what, uh, I think around... After six in the morning, and then what happened was, uh, I thought me and Booty we could we could we could have a thing, right? And then what happened is I went to Catmaster's room where he was chilling with uh, who's this? Uh, Iro and yeah, Jiga, right? Mm. So after that, uh, I asked the condoms, right? And then they said they don't have. And then after that, that's when literally I don't remember anything. And then when I woke up, I woke up in Catmaster's girl's room, right? And now it seems like I wanted to smash Catmaster's girl. And that was literally not the case. Oh, so you, you wanted know? to smash Boosie. Yay. Yeah. And then I blacked out in Catmaster's You are live room. on the podcast, come on. I repeat. <laughs> it's fine. I mean, look, it's the truth. It's what happened. But that's the look, story. He wanted to. Okay. He, we don't know if he would have. Yeah. Mm, mm. So, yeah, but that's, that's essentially the story. Oh, uh, long yeah. short, the long short of it. You know? how, how do you not remember going into Koketo and Jigger's woman's room? Yo, dude, I literally don't remember. I'm not going to lie. I literally don't remember. Hmm. Yeah, I so, genuinely don't remember. So they were also probably drunk then if you passed yeah, out. Yeah, they were I passed mean, out as well. Right in the middle of... No, 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 no. According, according, according to, to, to uh, Jigas Golden Bali, right? Mm. They, were, they, they weren't drinking at the party, according to them. They weren't drinking. So, ma'am, like, uh, what I don't understand is how could they not, like, remember how... Like, Bali says she remembers how I got in there, right? And then... But I'm like, okay, so, but, like, you didn't see that it's me that's getting in. She's like, no, I thought you kept master. But I'm like, how do you think I'm cat master you when it's like literally? Like yeah. I look nothing like cat master. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but also, I'm just like, okay, but you both of you guys were sober. And when I land, when I landed in the room, it's like it's like the first question is, okay, what do you want here? You know what I'm saying? But none of that happened. So Mbali thought I'm cat master, right? And then I slept on the bed uh, that. Catmaster's girl was on, 
And then in the morning, she got with me up. He's like, yo, dude, what are you doing here? I'm like, yo, dude, I don't know how the hell I ended up here. It's like, I think I got there maybe half past, like, what, to seven in the morning. And then, yeah, dog. And then, like, it was just, like, curls from there. And I'm like, dude, I genuinely don't know how I got here. So where was, where was Ente? I mean, uh, condom. Huh. The condom. Who? Hmm? The condom. Bussy. Bussy had the condom. No, 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 no. How Bussy did you did put it on, the condom? What? <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't have any. Oh, you didn't get any condom? <laughs> yes, I didn't get any from because uh, I went to Cat Masters. You didn't room. get any from who? <laughs> <laughs> from. <laughs> All right, come on, Ben. <laughs> hey, but dog, hey, you fucked up, dog. Yo, yo, yo. Yeah, no, that's the long shot of it, you know. Yeah, bro, like that looks bad, it man. Looks bad. It looks it bad. Yeah, it, it looks bad. So I know, it literally looks bad. And my whole thing is like, it, like I had zero intentions of of of, of wanting cat master's girl, you know what I'm saying? And when but I heard about the story, day, I'm the like, situation. Tabang, Tabang would yeah, never bro. do that. Ah, yeah. true. <laughs> <laughs> but I do remember Tabang in Cape Town. You remember Tabang in Yo, Cape Town, Tabang where you wouldn't in Cape Town. sleep? You were like, "There's no way I'm sleeping without getting any." And we drove around, we went to Woodstock, went to the oh, yeah. part of Cape Town. Do you remember, bro? Yeah, I, re- I remember that night in Cape Town. So I, I remember that night. that guy when he's drunk. Like, he's like, there's no way. There's no way. So, start the car. <laughs> no, but you apologize to the ladies, ne? Yeah, yeah, no, ah, definitely, beautiful. dude. Like, I told them, like, dude, and I told even Jigger, like, my guy, I literally have zero intention, you know what I'm saying? We went, we, we, we shared the same trip uh, back to Josie, and I told him, so I literally had zero intention yeah. of sleeping with Cat Master's woman, you know what I'm saying? And then I, I also like, spoke to him, but I'm like, yo, Joe, like, I don't understand how you thought like I was Cat Master, even though, even though as drunk as I was, yeah. I just don't get it. Mm. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, how you thought I was Cat Master, and you also allowed me. But, you know, like, also, like, not in my defense, but, like, when they got me, I was, like, so fully clothed, you know what I mean? And good, if, if, if I did want to do something with Cat Master's girl, she can testify to it, you know what I'm saying? Maybe if I did, did I wake her up? Did I wake her up? No, I didn't, you know? Hold on, Like, hold stuff on. like that, man. Yeah? Because of, he thought you were trying to get on with Cat Master's woman, not his woman. No, he thought I was trying to get with Cat Master's woman. He slept woman. in the middle. Yeah, I thought Jigga was pissed because of his girl mm. and him. Mm. And all no, 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 no. Oh, he just thought you're trying to get it on with my... My boys. My boys. boys women. Yeah. Mm. Essentially, yeah. What gave him that idea? Why Why not his woman? Yeah, because that's like... That, that's all I'm telling you. Like, I literally don't remember. Mm. Literally, after I walked out of Catmaster's room, oh. I literally don't remember what happened from there. But when I woke that's up, I woke friend. up in... Um, mm. What's this? I woke up in Catmaster's woman. Hey, we need to uh, make right? Catmaster's famous, man, so everybody can recognize him now. Otherwise, this won't happen. <laughs> no, don't do that. Yo, disaster. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but oh, that's a long story of the story. Famous. Oh. Oh. You make Catmaster famous? <laughs> Fuck, you'll regret it. You all, Catmaster. You all. Hey, sharp poison, sharp poison. You know what Catmaster okay, is? Nice like, shots. Just as nice. Oh, yeah. B- by, the way, b- by the way, shout out on the new intro. Everybody thinks it's Black Studio, but it's you. Hey. <laughs> I'm going to edit that one out. That is easy. Ah, I'm going to edit that one out. I don't remove it. Yeah, shout out. The new intro is amazing, dog. Beautiful. Shout out. Uh, nah, easy, easy, guys. Easy. It's beautiful, man. You're too okay, good. Okay, man. Boy. Yeah, I was shocked because I know Tabang. I've known him for a very long time and that's very uncharacteristic. Yeah, no, he's a stand-up guy. Yeah, he is. He's a good gent. He's a legit, like, great gent. He's even afraid of women because of all these allegations and stuff that's going on now. Tabang's a very... Tabang loves the honeys, though. When he's drunk. When he's oh, drunk. Real? When he's drunk. Oh, Catch him when he's sober. Never. Have you ever seen him with a girl? Like, with a woman? I've never seen Exactly. Him. He's I've afraid of women. He's afraid of women. I've seen Tabang with a girl. Where? Where? Yeah. Whoa. And propaganda. Hey. Oh, Sain Buji. Oh. Who was getting with Sain Buji? Who is Spiwe? Spiwe! 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 Nothing here. Spiwe, Spiwe, see we. Spiwe. See them. See them. Tell us, bro. Tell us, bro. I'm sure I'm trying to point. Hey, man. Hey. <laughs> and how I did not comment. Hmm? How was she? Hmm? Did you? Eh? Did you? Did you? 
Yeah? Mm -hmm. no, what? Did you get a kiss? Did you get a kiss? Allegation. <laughs> 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 oh fuck, did you see our episode reach a million views, man? Shout out to Sign Shout out to Sign, man. Shout out to Sign. Oh fuck, did you hear that? The uh, like KO Dis. Hmm? KO Dis Lady 2. No way. Yeah, KO Dis Lady 2 and Dooza. What? Yeah, at the, what did he say? What are the lines? What's the name of the songs people you you were playing it now now? Oh wow. Okay, let me hear it, eh? uh. Obviously you'll mute the sound so that we don't get flagged, uh. right? Sviso sent me. And I'm like, why? Why would Kale this lady do lady do such cool people? Mm. Search the lyrics. I don't want to sneak this thing. I don't. Is something I don't want to see a lady do. Yo! What did lady do say? Damn. Well, he says lady do posted. Damn! Like, it's not gold, country. Damn! It's, by then it was platinum. What Jeez. the fuck? Hey, you were in the head. Oh. Hey. hey, but you must know not to fuck with KO, bro. Hey, you don't mess with that nigga. Hey, you fetch you. What did lady do say? Let's call lady do. Aye, my man, aye. <laughs> You want to call everyone now? <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting a hold of anyone. <laughs> Reese Magusa. For real, what did you do, man? She tried to call me earlier. She's going to think. Okay, I'll tell her we're on the podcast. Let's call her. Yo, man, like... Jeez, damn. damn. Maybe two doesn't bother anyone. Nah, no. not at all, bro. Not Just at for all. a tweet. And now she got a whole diss track. Yo. Yo. I Thank you goodness we didn't get the smoke. Because, you know, K.O.'s fans have been coming at us hey. for saying that the beats... And he confirmed that they did buy the same beats as other... Like, they bought the beat and changed it. Mm. We didn't diss. We mentioned facts. Mm. That the beat sounds the same. Mm. I said they could have sampled the same source. Kind of they bought it from the same source. Mm. And people uh, are like, you know hey. people are always waiting for us, Doug. Mm. Bro. Joe, mm. sure, man, like... Do you think she'll respond, though? Well, I'm going to ask her. Oh, let's ask her. Let's call her. Lady D. Hey, yeah, man. What's up, brother? We're close to calling Basta because we're calling everyone on M7's way to today. <laughs> 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 Yo, Basta. Hey, hey, Basta. Hey, hey, we try to reach, but we'll just zoom. <laughs> ah, she's not answering, dog. She's not answering. Hey, yeah, I yeah. think it's... When did this song drop? Is it old? No, no, no. It's recent. Mm. It's got to be recent. It's got to be recent. It's got to be recent, yeah. This, uh, the, the, this. Well, the whole song... It dropped today. She dropped today. Drop I think today. that's why. I think that's why. Damn. And then, why would KO this um, Dooza? Weren't they part of Take S? Yeah, but you know they didn't uh, end things off nicely there. Mm. Is it? Did, oh, it's didn't a do reunion. Some... Well, Neil, we can't hear you, bro. Uh, Neil, <laughs> Neil, we can't hear you, bro, when you speak. Neil, oh, <laughs> we can't hear you when you speak. No, I'm but... saying from the lines, Keo just said, "Fuck the reunion. It's not gonna happen. The Tech is reunion." Yeah. So. Oh, so so it's not in Dusa thing. No, it's in Dusa thing. It's, uh, he's fine with my. E. What in, what in Dusa say? Did Dusa? He says in Dusa and his. Uh, and Dukza's girl are always bad mouthing him. I don't know. The white girl. Oh, so yeah, you're, I think you're so. God. Karen. The, the, name the name is Karen, yeah. Karen. Name is Karen. Yeah. Oh, that's why he said. Then he says, I'm going to leave Karen out of it. I'm going to continue with Grace. Mm. Mm. That's what the line then means. Yeah. No, there's, there's a line. There's a line there. Yeah. 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 Oh, now I get it. I'm not Karen. Because when he said Karen, I'm talking of a white lady race. But oh, now I get it. Yeah. Oh, damn, bro. Hey, shit is ugly. Sure. I wonder what happened to K. Hope we need to get that pissed. Piano is such, no one disses piano cats, man. In, in, like, Ow. piano cats don't want any trouble with anyone. But he's coming after a lady. Like, jeez. Ah, ah, yeah, 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 so, yeah, 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 so yeah, 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 For that reason. For that. For this reason, tell us more. So, for the man who gets a KOE GBV, you know, Hey, man, we are here, podcast and chill. Tell us more. Bye. Welcome to Black Excellence. Do not fear, for if you do, just sip on some grandeur. And if you still do, 
ask ourselves, what would Mapapunzi do? Parama chilla, itlesha lefiki. Ungo even if when they ask you, how sabi in, do not fear. For if you do, just say, Anistidi. This is the medicine of censorship. This is the pill. Which one is that one? Podcast and chill.